Guys, I'm here at my favorite tackle shop, Pro Advantage Sports and Hobbies, always tax free in Shannonville, Ontario. So I'm on a mission today. I want to get a tournament grade tackle kit that I can go fish any club event as a non-boater or a boater. I can go anywhere in southern Ontario, catch some big fish. And again, $150 is my budget. And the best part is Pro Advantage Sports and Hobbies has been good enough that we're gonna donate this pack and somebody's gonna be able to win this thing. So you're going to get a $150 tackle kit for absolutely nothing. All you have to do is like, share, and subscribe, and you'll be in a draw to win this kit. So let's get in there. We'll see what we can get for an absolutely awesome tackle kit, $150. Go fish any tournament in Southern Ontario. Okay, so I have a rough idea of what I want to get. I want to maximize our money. So I'm going to get a Jackal Rhythm Wave, lots of different colors. We'll go with this Gobi color, works good everywhere. I'm going to get a 3.8 Rhythm Wave. We'll get white. And then what else do we need? We need some hooks and stuff like that. So a 4 aught BMC, that should work good for everything. We'll get some wacky hooks. We'll use those for a couple different things. And we'll need some weights. This is really up to you, but I think I'm going to go here with the uh, 3 8 Should be good for lots of different things. And keep in mind, when I go home, I'm going to break this all down and show you how to hook it all up and how to use it. And we're going to need some drop shot weights. We'll just get lead. Let's go for quarter. Quarter is pretty good uh, standard size. And we'll get some of these Z-Man Ned Rig hooks. And again, the weight, it just depends what you want. I'm going to go with the uh, middle of the road here. Yeah. I'm going to get these ones. Okay. And what else do I need? So much good stuff. It's really easy to get overwhelmed. Okay, we'll go with some reaction buzz frogs. If you get these, they're called a Trixie shark. I call them like a buzz frog. I think I think I'm gonna go with the white because it'll work good as a frog and a trailer. And then we're going to Reaction Innovations Sweet Beaver. We'll just get black and blue. Works good everywhere. Okay. A couple more things. You're going to need a spinnerbait and you're going to want a chatterbait. You'll catch giant fish no matter where you're fishing on those two baits. Um, let's go with this one here. Project Z, it, it's a little more expensive than these ones. 
but I feel that it's worth the little bit extra money to get this. Yeah, so I'll get that. I'm gonna get the half ounce. It's a really good generalized kind of weight I can use anywhere. Spinner baits again, I'm gonna get half ounce. I'm thinking if I could only take one, I wanna take one that's on the whitish side, maybe a little color in the white. Nickels are awesome. This one's 11 bucks. We'll go with that. And we need a few more plastics. So Z-Man Finesse TRDs, these baits will catch fish anywhere again, lots of colors to choose from. I like pink, so I'm just going to go with a pack of pink. Definitely want some stick baits, Sankos. We're gonna go with these X Zones because they're only six dollars a bag and they look really good. They feel really good. I know they work good, so let's go with Green Pumpkin. Works good everywhere. Maybe I don't know what other color we should get. Doesn't really matter. Personal preference, right? Let's go with a rainbow trout for if I'm fishing like Lake Ontario or something like that. That color looks good out there. And then maybe a craw. Muscleback craw. That looks really good. We'll get that. And we'll do one more sweep and see if we need anything else. Jerk bait can be key. That's a real nice jerk bait. These work really good from Jackal. Those will get a good jerk bait. Catch fish anywhere. You know what it's like at the fishing store, right? I gotta look again. Well, I think we're good, guys. We got this little basket of stuff here. And I'm pretty sure that I've got everything in here that I could show up to a club, a club fishing tournament, anything like that. Come up as a non-boater. I could bring this stuff, do really well from the back or front of the boat. So we'll get up to the till. We'll see what it all comes to. Hopefully, it's definitely under 150 bucks. So let's get up there and find out. So we're gonna ring in. Hopefully, we're under 150 bucks. For enough stuff that we could go to a tournament. What are these for? Those are for catching big brown bass, Jamie. <laughs> Sorry, I had to make it to make it funny. The drop shot weights. We're going for some smallmouth. Or is this a mixture bag? Mixture bag. Mixture bag. With the rhythm waves. A must. Trailers by themselves in a small hook or in a net rig. Assuming that's your plan. Yes, sir. We'll help you pull it out being that there's no packs here. Absolutely. Yeah, remember guys, if you're in the area, this great shop, Pro Advantage Sports and Hobbies, I showed you outside. No tax, so it's really easy too, like when I'm looking that I think I should be under that mark because you don't have to worry about the tax. Good pick with some reaction elevations. Flipping beaver, Trixie Shark, good boost style bait. One of my favorite boats for us. I think you got everything here. 
short spinner bait. That's the idea. Tungsten? So this definitely wasn't a low budget pick. It's all really high end baits. So you don't need to spend a little to do well. You just need to buy the right baits. And we fight with that with a lot of people. Like you just don't have to worry about you know, spending too little. It's just buying the right ones with the money you have. You get what you need. <laughs> Basically, there's no junk going in the tackle box here, and you can use it for everything. So absolutely, that's the important part. Buying some baits that are versatile, they can cross back and forth into. You know, just spend your money right in the right spots, and uh, you don't need to buy as much tackles. Yeah, that's the most important thing. And colors, it's another thing. Keep your colors simple. Keep it natural. You don't need 50 colors of the same bait. <laughs> just buy a couple colors, you're good. You guys got gonna have some extra buy some coffee after this. Perfect cool. pop. Cool pop. Because you're at 142.95, so you basically got tournament grade selection for uh, $142.95. Okay, awesome. Thanks a lot, Jamie. So yeah, so like you said, 142 bucks, all really good quality stuff. 142 dollars Canadian. Remember that's Canadian. So we'll get home. I'll show you how to rig it all up how to use it, and how versatile this stuff's all going to be and how many different options you're going to have. So thanks a lot, Jamie. No See problem. you later. I got to mention something, though. Although we got everything, I think you're missing one thing. What's that? I don't see it. I mean, I see a buzz frog, which everybody likes to throw a buzz frog. It's a tricky shirt by Rationation. But I don't see a hollow body frog We're on top of pads, nice and slow. Absolutely right. So if you went with a scum frog, though, that are right around, or a lunker hunt, you're at eight to ten dollars. You're going to be one hundred and fifty-two ninety-five or one hundred and fifty ninety-five. Like your rate on that edge of, and that's the only thing I would add to this whole thing would be a hollow body frog. Okay. Yeah. So absolutely right. Let's go get a hollow body frog since we got a little bit of money left over. Oh yeah, we got a really nice selection of different lunker hunt frogs. The bottom black or white. Yeah, I like black frogs. Jamie's right. That's a nice frog. So we're gonna add that. That was nine dollars. And like we said before, there is no tax, so that puts you at $151.95. So $1.95 would be at $150 mark. That's, that's perfect. perfect. Right on. Thanks again, Jamie. No so. problem. Thank you. Okay, everyone. So I'm back from Pro Advantage. It's actually the next day. So I'm going to go through here, like I said. I'm going to show you why I picked these baits. Um, they're all really high quality baits, like I said yesterday. And we're going to go through and see how versatile they are, why I picked them, and the many different things you can do. So for $150 Canadian, around 100, 110 US, you can go fish any tournament probably, just about anywhere with these baits and do just fine. So I wanted to pick a 4 aught wide gap hook, picked out these VMCs. Reason for that is I'm going to show you right now, they're going to work for lots of different things here on the table. Now I'm not going to open these because little surprise. I'm going to give you until July, let's go 12th. So until July 12th, like, share, subscribe. And I'm going to give this whole package away as a kit and I'll ship it to you wherever you are if you're not local. So we'll put these four aughts back in here. I got an open one here. And I'm not going to hook these baits, okay guys? Because like I said, we're going to give them away. So Reaction Innovations. Trixie Shark, plastic frog type bait. So you can rig this like a Texas style. So you'd put it through just like this. Okay. And you can run that over the top of lily pads, different kinds of weeds, whatever. And that works really well on its own. 
but we're not done with that yet. So we're not going to put that in the box yet. We're going to put it aside here. Again, a hook. We got these X-Zone. What are these ones called here? Muscleback Craw. Really nice looking craw, especially for the price. Again, you're going to Texas rig this. 4 aught, as you can see, fits that bait really nice. And with that, you're going to use your Ultra Tungsten. Okay. I picked these ones here, 3 8 3 8 works just about good for everything, anywhere. It's not too heavy, not too light. If you can only get one pack, that's the pack that I choose. It's 3 8 so we can put a 3 8 on this, and that's a really nice flipping bait. Now we get to Sankos. I got two different colors of Sankos. I got these X-Zone ones because they were priced really fair. Um, they're a lot less than Yamamoto and stuff like that, and they still work really well. So with the Sanko, You can fish it like this with this same 4 aught wide gap hook. Okay. So you can fish that like that with no weight. Texas rigged, no weight. Then you got tungsten. So you can go back to your tungsten. You can Texas rig it the same way, same hook with a tungsten weight. We also got these VMC wacky hooks. So. You have two packs of Sankos for your $150. You can wacky rig your Sanko on this. You can Texas rig it no weight. You can Texas rig it with a weight. So right there, you have three different options just with one bait. And I'm gonna show you another one here that I thought for, how much for these weights? $4. So. For four dollars, I got a pack of weights, and these are for drop shotting. If you haven't really used drop shot technique much, give it a try. It's, it's a must, really. You got to have it in your box. So now we have four things we can drop shot these Sankos also on this same hook. Now, seeing as how we're talking drop shot, oh, give me one sec here. Let's just put these away. So the Sankos, let's just put those away for a second. Got another bait, 2.8 inch Rhythm Wave. This is the Gobi color. So these baits here are absolutely phenomenal for lots of things also. Drop shotting them. So we'll take this same Rhythm Wave, we'll drop shot it on the same hook with the same drop shot weight. And you know, you can pick all kinds of different sizes, quarter ounce, it's pretty good for everything unless you're in like heavy current or super deep water. So that's that for these drop shot. But we also got these net heads. So with these net heads, what we can do is we can thread this rhythm wave onto this net head. And again, the, the weights and stuff are up to you, you know. I just kind of go middle of the road and it tends to work for just about everything. So you just thread this on here, you reel in the rhythm wave nice and slow, hop it around, swim it, you'll catch smallmouth bass, largemouth bass, perch, crappies, just about anything with this technique. These two things here, I have a rod specifically set up just for this. So to be able to get these in this package and then incorporate it with drop shotting, it's, you know, it, it's really handy, it's a really good value. So 2.8 rhythm waves. We also got some Z-Man TRDs. I just happened to pick pink. I like the pink ones. I like lots of the different colors, but on a budget, pink always works pretty good. So that's all those look like. They're designed to go on this head, or maybe I should say this head is designed for these TRDs. So you just thread that on there, nice and straight. It just, well, I don't have that hook out here, but it just sits on there like so. And that will catch you fish 
just about anywhere. Unfortunately for the TRD, that's about all that I really do with it. I mean, you can put it on a drop shot if you want to. Um, I just prefer the rhythm wave most times, but you can use it on a drop shot. So it does have another purpose there. That's those. Now we had to get a frog, you know, just a hollow body plastic frog. Chose this Lunker Hunt one. You can see there, it's got nice legs that really kick out. This isn't something that's super versatile to one purpose, but the purpose is amazing. You need a frog. If you wanted, that's one of the things that I was saying though, if you wanted to cut this package back, um, you know, a couple of things that you could cut out is maybe this frog, maybe the TRDs, because you can use this as your frog instead of a nice hollow belly frog. But anyway, a spinner bait. You absolutely need a good spinner bait. These Nichols ones are phenomenal. I usually like to get a half. A half ounce is good pretty much anywhere. You can always reel faster to get it up over top of those weeds. I went with one like a whitish color with a little bit of chartreuse because white works good everywhere. Add a little color to it. You know, probably good spinner bait anywhere. And for this, if you want a trailer on it, you can use your Trixie Shark. I wouldn't use it as a full trailer. I would maybe cut it. I've even seen guys cut it in half and use one leg on their spinner bait. So that's very important for finding fish and catching them. Chatter bait, bladed jig. Again, we could have gone a little cheaper but you want good quality stuff that's gonna work right, it's gonna feel good, and it looks really nice, it's got good hooks. So, you know, get good quality tackle and not necessarily more tackle. So, with this chatterbait, again, I went with the same kind of idea. I wanted white, a little bit of color, so it's gonna be good pretty much anywhere. Now for this, you do need a trailer. Works much better. Again, you can use your Trixie Shark as a trailer on that. So this is also super versatile. We're gonna rig it on that same 4 aught VMC hook. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna rig it like a Texas rig. Let's put it through to about the bend. Beadless. Nice and flat skin hook and there you go you can throw that with no weight you can throw it through all kinds of different weeds uh, thick or thin sparse or super thick docks you know around trees all that kind of stuff and you know something i don't really usually talk about too much is i'll use this i'll flip this with an ultra tungsten and flip it like you would one of these craw baits and sometimes the fish just absolutely drill this thing, fish that way. I'm not sure I should uh, be talking about that too much. But anyway, that's another thing that makes these super versatile. And then we got another flipping bait, the Reaction Innovation Sweet Beaver. So that's the Sweet Beaver. Phenomenal, phenomenal flipping bait. You see how it's shaped? And with your tungstens on there, it fits perfect with that ultra tungsten. So you flip that into heavy weeds, docks, trees, same idea. But you do need some variety for flipping. But flipping is definitely key. Now I split the tail on this one, okay? And when they come, this tail is not split. It's just flat like a beaver. You can leave it like that if you wish for more flapping action or split it apart for a little bit more erratic action. Sorry whoever wins this, I split the one open on you. Okay, so we're done with those. We're done with those hooks. Done with all this stuff. Now, a jerk bait. 
You may want to pick a different color. Doesn't really matter. I picked this one just because I liked it. Other good colors are just pure white. There's a purple one that's really good. Um, but this kind of a color, like a silvery, it's got some blue in it, a little black. It'll work anywhere, and that's why I picked it for this pack. Because we're not going specifically somewhere that, you know, the fish like a white jerkbait or a purple jerkbait. This color will work anywhere. And a jerkbait is way more versatile than what people may think. You can work it slow, hold your rod up over top of weeds. You can crank it hard, jerk it down, you know, five feet range. Depending on the line you're using, a little deeper, a little shallower. Um, work it on weed lines, around trees. I worked around docks, especially if they're deeper docks for smallmouth and largemouth. Everywhere you go, you will catch fish on a jerkbait. Okay, so that's it. That's our whole kit for $150. I hope you can see why I chose these baits. And I hope you like the selection that I got and uh, approve of why I got them and how versatile most of the stuff is. The stuff that isn't versatile, it's just necessary, but it's going to catch fish anywhere. So, thanks a lot for watching, everyone. Again, special uh, thanks to Pro Advantage Sports and Hobbies in Shannonville, Ontario here. So, like, subscribe, share, and uh, thanks a lot, everybody. Have a good summer.